Hello, my lovelies, my lovely Shadow here. Welcome back to some more Amateur Surgeon. Now this time, I am going to beat Carl in this one. So, I am fully determined, so I'm just going to jump right in and just start this without even a hassle. It's no problem, guys. The last time, I messed everything up and I couldn't do it per I couldn't do it right. So, right now, I'm in an okay pace. And we're just going to clean up the nasties like usual. So that way I can do the do's and seal up these wounds. Alright. We've seen to seal up these wounds pretty clearly. We are at a good pace. Tongy tongue. Number four. I keep forgetting about the number things, which I should be doing instead of just going up and clicking. Now here comes the hard part, where I scan and take out all those coffee packets. But I'm going to do them each one by one. Very, very slowly. And carefully pull this out. There. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Suck this all up before the nasties come in. Alright, his heart monitor is going up super fast, so make this quick. I better make this quick. Okay, now into the second one. There we go. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. Just remove all the scabbies. Or the nasties. Alright. The last one. Here we go. This is the last one. Alright. <gasps> no, he crashed! What? Uh oh. That's fine, we're fine. I just gotta go back again. Okay, hurry, hurry, hurry. Come on. Okay, thank you. Come on, come on, come on. Get up all the scabbies, all the nasties. Scabbies. Come on, come on, come on. No, it's gonna spread. It's gonna spread. Okay, thank you. Carl, don't you dare crash here on me. The game lagged a bit, but I kept strong. Yes, alright. I think we did it, guys. I think I did it, at least. The music, again, is gonna give me the concentration. Alright. Just gonna close you up. And... Boom. Oh, wowee! Oh, yowza! You got it! Oh, I could kiss you! I could kiss the coffee! That sweet, sweet mocha temptress. <laughs> You're welcome! Nice! I got a B! Now I know the rest I get I've been getting C's, but I really don't care at this point. The game has been lagging, so now we're gonna do animal. Hey you there! I'm sick. Ate something that disagreed with me. Was it fast food? <laughs> I know that feeling because you know how we all eat fast food and the body just disagrees ten seconds later. Not especially. I caught him while I was wearing my straight jacket, after all. Har har har. Let's get him on the table and get him the heck out of here. Agreed. <laughs> kind of lagged there a bit. There was multiple police. Did you see that? Oh well, probably just me. Anyway. Oh god! Bones! Simple extraction of bones. First of all, what did you eat? Well, everything just looks simple enough. Number four. Patch you up. 
Now we're going inside the stomach. Oh, that's just not right. Whoa. Is that a finger? Okay. Oh, who did you eat? It was ju just an innocent person. Oh my god. Why did I not see this sooner? Like, I'm not gonna lie. That is physically impossible to eat a person. Better give him some health before he dies. Okay. Chainsaw. What I miss? Thank you. Oh, the number things. I keep forgetting the number things. Okay. My goodness. How does one eat a person? He was just in a he, or I, I hope it's a he. He was just innocent. I wonder what he did to make him eat him. There we go. I recognize you, Dr. Bleed. Really? I. me? How? I saw you. Saw you when I was in the old hospital. All those people died. Dog, what's he talking about? You were the big pen fairy! Dance fairy, dance your pixie dance for me again! Ha ha! Woo! Okay. Uh, the old hospital is true. Or is he just crazy? Doc, what that guy said. Did you work at the old hospital? I heard about that. It shut down because a bunch of people died. Alan, I want to know what happened, Doc. But I'll have to wait. We've got a patient. Excuse me. Wow. Okay. I love how Alan Probe is now getting more and more into the whole theory behind Dr. Bleed. And how he's sl on how they're slowly developing the connection more and more. Well, at least by doc Dr. Bleed doesn't look like he th isn't the type of guy to talk stories and nonsensical questions. So here, go away. And But Alan is definitely loving this so much. Alright, oh my gosh, we're back with Eddie. Hey, you're Eddie? Dog, help me. They, someone set a dog on me. I, he's in a bad way. We need to get going. Oh, no. The return of Eddie the dog. What did that doggy do to you? You got some scratches and you do slice up the flesh. Oh, how does one slice up a flesh in the, inside the wound? The wound. Did I just say wound? My bad. The wound. Sorry. Is this a dog bite? That is a big dog bite. Okay. This seems simple enough. clean this up and then let me give you more health okay hurry hurry okay Oh, you're dying. He's dying. That's not good. Oh, I gave you a scratch. Come on. This is time consuming. I can't see where the scratches are. Okay.
Come on, hurry. There's still a little health left. <gasps> no! <gasps> He's dying. Oh, I gave you a cut. I hate giving little cuts. It takes up time. Got a minute left, come on. Okay. Time to take off your kidney. Looks so bad. Shoot! Why did I do that? Okay. Patch you up. Uh oh. Okay. This better be the last thing. If not, I am so screwed. Hey, cool. He'll pull through, but that was attempted murder. Who's doing this? And what happened at the old hospital? What happened with you? I... I will explain what I can, Alan. But for now, it looks like we have another patient. Ah, Doc, you can't leave me hanging like this. I want to know now. Me too. I'm very curious. And Act 2 is now complete, guys. Now go wash your hands. Do it. Go wash your hands. Right now. Go wash your hands. Okay, so now that we've all washed our hands, uh, we are now going to move on with Act 3, Patient Files 3. Now that I will try to maybe do these three up here, Trent, Peter, and Henchman Boss. See if I can pull through. Let's, let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Guys, <laughs> I was just walking alone, minding my own business, and suddenly some girl stabbed me. Look! Oh, jeez. Why are you naked? <laughs> Ellen, whatever happened, those wounds are deep. We need to operate. Yes, operate, operate. That oh my god. There's a blade right through. Oh my gosh. Um, oh. I don't know why you need the chainsaw. That's the thing I still don't understand to this day. I remembered that because the last time I used a taser, I tased the freak out of this guy and he just died. So. I'm gonna give this guy, Trent boy, some health after I patch these wounds up. Oh shoot, what just fucking scared me. The least you'd expect is killing scorpions with a chainsaw. That's the least you would expect. Thank you! Oh my goodness. I was too focused on the freaking queen, killer queen, 
scorpion, but I finally did it. Okay. Why do the cuts always do this to me? They always end up having to be in order of wanting to patch up. Let me give him, give him some health. I think this is the last one, hopefully. Yes. Oh, it's the girl. Where is he? I will kill him. You're the girl from the warehouse. What? Were you following Trent? You're the one who's been undoing all my work. Do you have any idea how hard I've been working to take those filthy criminals down? She was the one behind all this? She crazy. What? You're the one going around attacking everyone? I just said that. As you're the one going around attacking everyone? I thought it was that Horace guy. That's what I thought too. Did you guys thought? Did you guys thought it was Horace? Who? You disgust me. But it doesn't matter. I've almost got him. I've been waiting so long. Wait. Alan. That girl who was just here. She's the one from the warehouse that showed up after I fixed the creepy French dude I tried to tell you. I know that girl. I believe it's me she's looking for. She wants to kill me. What? That's insane. Huh? I'm afraid not. Oh god, he's crying. I killed her parents. I am a murderer, Alan. What the fuck? She can explain to her to you herself. We are going back to the old hospital. My old hospital. Oh shit. Well, the tables have turned. Wow. Okay. Well, it's good to know that he was a vicious murderer. Well, no wonder why he's been avoiding things lately. That explains all the questions that he's been avoiding. Like, oh my goodness. Guys, I think I'm going to have to stop this here. I know, I know. The cliff cliffhanger right there. But I really, really want to know more about what happened to this girl. Oh, apparently her name is Ariella. Ariola? Ari... Ariola. I guess called Ariola. About her parents being murdered by Dr. Ignatius Bleed, which I thought was my dear friend. He's still a friend dear to my heart, alright? I don't think he meant it. Or who knows what's going to happen in the story. But I'm going to leave this here. But I'm going to thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you're enjoying this series. I will definitely play more of the series. But thank you all lovely so much for watching. And I will see all you guys lovelies. Messed that up. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. And I'll see y'all in the next fin, in the next one. Thank you and good night. She's bus. Oh, I'm sorry. I, th I thought you were a dude dressed like a. That's why I said like, just like a chief hooker. Sorry. I guess I asked for that. Listen, I suffer from multiple personalities, which is bad for business. Could you, you know, fix me? All right. A transgender with strange personalities. That's something you don't see every day. Let's give her some help. We're gonna cut open her head. This stupid game is going slow on me. Do I just die? Come on.